And the 800 HD is really designed for the mid to high handicap player, the player who's looking to, for a long iron that's going to launch extremely easy and a club that's going to be really forgiving regardless of where you hit it. On top of that, it's a club that's designed to actually hit it really long. It's got a high COR design with a max core pocket cavity. It's designed so that ball speeds off the face are extremely high and the ball's just going to go a long way. And really what we did with this is when we designed the JPX 800 line, the Pro and the regular 800, we kind of held back a little bit because the 800 was designed to be really a mass audience club. It's designed for balanced performance, for it to fit at any type of golfer. With the HD, we really, we didn't hold back at all. We wanted to make it as forgiving, as high launching, as easy to hit as possible. Your typical miss hits go from low heel to high toe. By placing the weighting right in those spots, we really twisted the sweet area so that it's going to going to perform better right where the typical amateur player miss hits it. When you look at the 800 HD set just kind of from the sole view, you'll really notice an aggressive flow from the 4 iron down to the wedge. The 4 iron, we didn't hold back. We wanted to make it the most forgiving 4 iron as possible, almost like a hybrid in terms of performance. It's a really wide sole, longer head, but then as you get into the 6 iron, it gets a bit narrower, a bit narrower, and then on the pitching wedge, it actually looks like a proper pitching wedge at address. Because no one really needs an oversized, bulky pitching wedge, but when on the 4 iron, when the loft is a little bit stronger and it's tougher to hit, you want that little bit of added forgiveness and added comfort level when you put it down behind the ball. When we designed the 800 HD, we designed it with the new JPX lofts, which are a bit stronger than the MP lofts. The reason for that is because with this, with this club head design, with the deeper center of gravity and the hotter face, the ball is naturally going to jump way up in the air. So if we were to put a weaker 8 iron loft on it, it might almost go too high. So even though this is three degrees stronger than I play my eight iron, you can see the ball flight's really high. It looks like an eight iron ball flight. It's not taking off like a six iron. So really what we were able to do with this is capture an eight iron ball flight, but just give you even more distance with it. My name is Chris Fochel, and I'm a golf club designer for Mizuno.